Hello, today we're going to be doing some math problems for you. We're going to be doing these three. And what we have to do is simplify by rationalizing the, de the denominator. Now to do so, we're going to take each problem and multiply it by something that equals 1. So for problem A, which is 3 over the square root of 6, we're going to multiply that by something that equals 1. So in this case, we're going to multiply it by the square root of 6 over 6, which is actually a number 1, a number 1 in disguise, or noid. So now that we have that, we'll multiply it out. We get 3 times the square root of 6 over 6. Now we can simplify that further. And we'll take a 3 out, and we'll get the square root of 6 over 2. And that's our answer for A. For B, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to multiply our problem by something that equals 1. And in this case, since we have a cube root here, we'll try and make our denominator a perfect cube. So we'll multiply by the cube root of 2 over the cube root of 2. And we'll get 2, the cube root of 2, over the cube root of 8. And we'll simplify that out. And we'll get 2, the cube root of 2, over 2. We can take a 2 out of each side. And we'll get the cube root of 2 as our final answer. For C, we're going to be looking for a fourth root, and we're going to multiply by a number that equals 1. So in this case, we're going to multiply by the fourth root of x to the third over the fourth root of x to the third. And we'll come up with, which is actually a number 1 in disguise, or noid. We'll multiply that out. We get 10 times the fourth root of x to the third over x. And that is, is as much as you can simplify that problem. And that is how you simplify by rationalizing the, the denominator.